Hello, this is Greg Brannon to another episode of Liberty Moments. We are in a constitutional crisis. We have our representatives who break their oath and not follow the contract that we, sovereign states, put together called the Constitution. Two very good examples to show how we such legally court-minded at all the time. We have Speaker Boehner who wants to sue the President. There's no function for that. But we do have one. It's called impeachment. The House has the, has the power of inquiry and has the power of impeachment. The Senate has the power of being the jury. Use it. No need to go to a branch of the federal government, which is a branch of the agent, to take a court case. Because in Article 3, there's no power there for the Supreme Court. The next one is Governor Jindal from Louisiana. She wants to, he wants to sue the federal government for Common Core. I am no fan of Common Core. There's no role of the federal government involved in education. I agree 100% with the governor, except his modus operandi. We have three very important clauses in our contract that could supersede anything the federal government is doing. First one is Article 6, Clause, uh, clause 2. The Constitution is supreme law in the land and pursuant thereof. Pursuant thereof means that if it's not enumerated in Article 1, Section 8, they have no function. And the power to hold them to those chains is the legislative of each state. Louisiana, stand up. Also, the Ninth Amendment protects the individual's enumerated rights, which are innumerable. There's infinite. And the Tenth Amendment protects a sovereign state to protect the people. Madison said they're duty-bound. So for both you, Speaker Boehner, for you, Governor Jindal, we have the constitutional answer. Let's stand up and hold that contract. It will hold them and bind the federal government only if we, if we stand firm to that. Understand, understand that the true keepers of the Constitution are we the people, and our state legislators and our federal representatives must honor their oath. Thank you very much for this opportunity in Liberty Moments. This is Greg Brandon. to next week.